going to make a doll room inspired by the Barbie video game developer. I like the background so much that I just have to make a room. Using cardboard, and here I am recycling an older craft. Scrapbook paper, lots of printables from our blog, a few craft ideas from previous videos, and glue. I start by cutting the cardboard so I have two walls and a floor. Begin covering them with scrapbook paper. I used a wood grain on the floor, brick on the outside, and on the inside, we've done a lot of white rooms lately, so I am going to make one pink wall and use printables from our blog on the other. We made one of the printables to look like there are shelves, action figures, and posters on the wall to make an instant backdrop. We can use more printables to add a window to the room. We remade the table from our doll craft room video, only this time we're painting it white. To make a desk, recycle a paperboard box, cover it with scrapbook paper to make the base for a twin bed. Now I don't want to overload the room with pink, so I make our traditional white bedding. I cut out printables from our blog and I can glue them directly onto the wall or add a few layers of cardstock. After a few layers, the paper becomes stiff. Repeat for the other screens, then glue them all onto the cardstock. Cut it out. I made sure there was a little space in between the screens so I can bend the paper. Apply glue to the back of the center screen, then glue it to the wall, leaving the other three screens free so they can be angled. Glue more printables onto layers of cardstock to make a keyboard, game controllers, a laptop, and for the laptop, I used one layer of cardstock, then I separated the pieces for the back, added a few more layers of cardstock, then glue them onto the back to make it thicker while allowing it to open and close. We use a stool from our doll classroom and the beanbag chair that we made with our mini sewing machine. We use more printables and cut them out, fold on the lines, glue cardstock inside for the front, back, and spine, fold over and glue the edges, fold the strips of paper accordion style, glue the pages inside to make books. Add mini toys like my mini Mixie Cues and it looks like the room is just about finished. However, our computer could use a mouse. So I'm going to make a quick mouse using child size press-on nails. I cut a rounded square from doll packaging, glue on the nail, draw or paint thin lines to make a mouse on a mouse pad. Finish the room with our doll headset from a previous video. And you're done. Happy crafting! to give a shout out to Savannah Dottie. What's up? I just have to ski past the ice cream cones and... Oh man, I lost again. And it's always to Little Miss Panda Cupcake, whoever that is. Yay, I won again. Well, that was just too easy.